This brief video is part of a larger series exploring the new NX measure command. In this video I'll show you when to use the object set selection. Object set selection is very useful if you're particularly creating cumulative results. For instance, if we start here with a couple of solid bodies, we select one solid body, we'll see the properties of that one solid body. If we select a second solid body, we'll start to get a minimum distance between those two bodies. And if we actually wanted cumulative combined uh, mass properties there, the object set will help us to get there. So for instance, here again, if we go to the object set, select a couple of solid bodies, we select the first one, we get the mass properties of that solid body. So the mass you can see here is 0 0.0098, for instance. If we add a second body to this set, we'll start to get, or a third body, we'll start to get cumulative results for that combined set of objects. Similarly, we can use that object set and measure from that object set to another object or object set. So for instance, in this case here, we could add a new set, the second one, maybe even make that second one just an object, right? And measure from that set of bodies to this curve, for instance, and get the minimum distance from that set of objects to the curve. We could then go back to that object set, for instance, and deselect objects in that set to see the minimum distance again between that set of objects and another object out there. 